hard name products I've ever been able to offer and it absolutely makes perfect, perfect sense. It comes to us from Compass Home. All of us want privacy. We hide things in our yards, trash cans, <laughs> recycling bins, that barbecue grill that should have been replaced four summers ago. Well, how do you do it? Well, fencing doesn't work. So this company came to QVC with a wonderful trellis idea last year that people went nuts for, actually sold out very quickly. Yes. Uh, we went back to them in the off season and said, how do we make it bigger? How do we make it better? How do we make it fuller, more lush, even more attractive? And this is brand new. I want to introduce you to Michelle Stretch. Good How morning. are you? Good morning, welcome, friends. welcome. How are you? Good morning, uh, everybody. I am an outdoor guy. Yes. I hate the look of chain link fence. It looks like a little prison, okay? <laughs> this is completely different. Yeah. It comes in a gigantic <laughs> roll. This is a six foot, you get two, yep. uh, you get a choice of either size. Six foot or 10 foot. It is oh, in its own self, similar to chain, but it's all done in a green color. This is customizable and we'll get into yes. that. But it is lush with more great outdoor quality, artificial foliage than we've ever seen on any of the other products. That is gorgeous. There's over 1,100 leaves on that. And this is Compass Home. Great innovators in indoor and outdoor uh, home products. Functional and beautiful. And there's the six foot. Want to open up the 10 foot to sure. show how large that is? We're going to lay that so, down. Yeah, so here's the 10 foot. You ready? Foot. So easy to do. All you do, and look how flexible this is. We're going to show you a couple of applications it here. Will, it will how not stand on its great own. Is that? You're going yes. to attach it to something else. Uh, we what give I, you uh, 12 ties as well, zip ties. What I did last year, I have a piece of trellis work where uh, on the way my old farmhouse is designed, it's a trellis that actually uh, covers up a crawl space. And I hated that area, hated the trellis. And then you guys came out with this idea Look and up. and now it just all blends in. It just virtually disappears. Yeah, it's wonderful. So look what we have here. Most of us have these garbage cans around. Here's that yep. chain link fence that is just so ugly, right? So all you do is just roll this out. And by the way, this is a six foot piece that we actually cut down. That's how you can customize these. You, you customize these it down. to what you're going to use it on. Yep. Oh, my, and then my. you're going to get the, the zip ties to go along with it. It takes a few minutes to do your installation and then you leave it out. And by the way, this stays green all year long. If it snows, don't worry about it. If it rains, it's not a problem. Uh, the stuff is built to be outdoors and it yeah. doesn't sun bleach. Yes, that's the nice thing. It is treated so it does delay the effects of fading from the sun. Here we used a 10 foot and a six foot and this is what's wonderful about it too. You can go around a corner like this mm -hmm. if you wanna do that. So it's great. If you wanna sit out on your deck and drink your coffee in your pajamas, Dan, in the morning you can hide yourself no one, from your no neighbors. No one needs to see no that. One, no one needs to see that, yes. correct? The other thing too that I love and I wanna just show over here, if you wanna do something, this is purely decorative so it, it's very functional and that you get that privacy you're gonna hide those things but we cut this down too okay. so you can make a decorative look too and you don't have to worry about ivy ivy's difficult to take care of uh, yes, ivy yes, can it ruin is. things so now you have this gorgeous look that's full and thriving and bright green uh, all year long we put it on our stone wall yeah uh, just to give it a different look but it's a matter of this goes in areas where regular trellising just will not go uh, and it, again, it does not stand up on its own. It must be affixed to something else, but you're gonna find lots of applications for this. Look at how pretty that is. And maybe you have some staining or some mold or something on a wall. You can cut that down. We actually cut that down to one foot in height. So if you get a 10 foot uh, right. fence, you, you will have, you know, you'll be able to use 10 of those. And it's, it's wonderful. You're gonna cut vertically too. You can use the scissors. You don't need a special tool to do that. Yep. We give you the 12 zip ties as well. So you could just, you know, very easy. You're just gonna cut it straight down and customize it. So it's good to stock up on a lot of these. You're gonna find a lot of great places. Every property them. has its little Achilles heel. Uh, for me, the one that has been making me nuts for a while, my oil tank, and that's how we heat our entire farm is oil, and yeah. it's an old, old farm, 1780. My oil tank is in my front yard. <laughs> Why the heck they, they put it there? They didn't think of aesthetics back it's then, right? It's right there by the kitchen door, <laughs> and I've got this 
quote privacy fence around it, but it stands out yeah. like a sore yeah. thumb. You take this. So I figured out if I get two of the ten footers, I have enough to completely yeah. block all of that visually. You know, and again, we're just showing you here, you can hang these vertically as well. We have some nail holes in here that we wanted to cover up. Yep. And it just adds that beautiful, green, lush, thriving look. And this again, Good. you know, it, this is not just purely decorative. Right. You're covering something that's somewhat of an eyesore here. Uh, and there's, I've, we've never had anything like this before. And it, the best part is, I know that this company has done great success in catalogs. But in the catalog, I didn't get a chance to see all the different applications. Yeah. And we, we've got it, by the way, at a very, very good price. So you pick your six foot and your 10, and let's give them dimensions, the actual height of 40 it. 40 inches. 40 inches. 40 inches okay. tall, which is over, over three feet tall, and then you get a choice of either the six foot yep. or the 10 foot. And there, I'm just putting this, I have a hook here on the end, but you do get those twist nice. ties for the sake of demonstration here. So again, I'm going to go with two of the 10 footers yeah. because I can stack them one on top, and that's a six foot privacy fence that goes around that oil tank. Yep. And I've got, this is what's nuts, I've got ivy that grows on our property like wild, and I fight with it all year long. It gets out of control, yeah. It gets crazy. With this, there's no maintenance whatsoever. Look at that. I love that. And you know, you can put it on the inside of the deck, put it on the outside of the deck. It's just so, so pretty. If you wanted to add, you know, put little flowers in there, or if you wanted to put lights in there, you could make it, you know, even more decorative if you'd like. But it's nice to have, and you can have it up year round too, Dan. Yes. You don't have to worry don't about worry it. Don't worry about it. It could be summertime. Uh, this we is we had you can have an, an Ask Us Live question from one of yes. our audience members saying, okay, let's say I'm going to get more than one. Yep. Which is, again, that's what I'm going to wind up doing. How do you connect one to the other? It's really simple. Zip ties. Zip ties. Zip ties. And, by, zip and ties. the zip ties come with it. Even the zip ties are the same shade of green yeah. as the product, so it disappears. Uh, yeah. yeah. You know, Easy. I'm willing to, and I'm a, you know me, I'm a cheapskate. I am willing <laughs> to spend money for privacy. And there's so many fencing materials out there that just are not attractive. White plastic works on some properties, but I mean, not yeah. for a lot of and you know what? others. Yeah. A lot of us don't have that. A lot of us don't have nice looking fences. Maybe we moved into a house and there's there's things that are already there that you might not have wanted, but the budget doesn't allow for changing sure. it. So yep. all you do is you pick up one of these, you just roll it out. You're going to hide those trash cans. Michelle, You're going to hide that. Sneaky. It, it is kind of. You can of, hide you know a what? myriad of sins. God knows what's under with there. With this, yes, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so true, but it's just beautiful. And those leaves too, Dan. Over 1,800 leaves on that 10 foot. I mean, that is, that, I mean, we counted. And by the way, 1,100 on the six foot. Every single one of them is mounted by hand. Yes. Look there is that. no Lush. machinery currently anywhere in the industry that can do this in an automated fashion. Yeah. So our price of $45 for the 10 footer is extremely reasonable. Uh, you know, when you go to the, the hardware store and you buy anything that has coverage, flooring, like carpeting, tile, et cetera. They, they charge you by the square foot. That is an extremely reasonable price. Yeah. Now, this is what I'm going to urge you to do. Jot down the item number. And I'll read it off to you. Michelle, I'll be right back. Okay. I have it written down. Look at the that. item Trash number is M48530. And then measure. Just measure what it is you want to cover. Yep. We've got a six foot length which is going to be 40 inches tall, six feet in length, and then we've got the 10 foot. And you can work in measurements thereof. By the way, you want to order a little bit more than what you need with the understanding that it can all be cut down yeah, to fit exactly. I would say if you're not sure, go with the 10 foot. It's actually, you know, a little bit better of a value. Yeah. So if you go with the 10 foot, you know, you can cut that down. You can also make a decorative look too. This is purely decorative. You know, if you love the look of hanging ivy, but you don't want all the complications, as you said, it gets ivy, out of control. Ivy is a voracious plant. And it ruins the, it ruins, it, does. it ruins brick. It ruins You've been to my house. You know, you know the, the spring house in my yeah. front yard that's been covered with ivy for yeah. years? We finally pulled it off and yep. found out that it had actually eaten its way into the mortar joints. So I've got to redo all of that in the spring. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And that's just what you really want to add that to your list of things to do in the spring. No, uh, because my to-do so. list is so small. <laughs> <laughs> it's so true. Okay. Yeah. Look so, at this. Look, you can just cut this down. We cut this down. This is about a foot and a half this way. 
Um, so we could we basically got four of these out of a six foot. So if you have okay. two areas that you want to cover, very easy to do. I have another little area right over here. Oh, you know really, what's funny? I didn't even see that. Yeah, right here. I mean, yeah. you know what? If you have a corner somewhere, because this is so flexible, we have a, a hook that we hung up on this side. You know, we have some stuff back there you might not want to see. Maybe you have your your um, garden equipment. We all or have some, to hide trash cans we do, somewhere. We do. All right. And we want to hide ourselves sometimes too from our neighbors, really, if you think about that. Yeah. Or vice versa, right? Uh, it's funny, my, my producer Frank, and I love working with this guy, and I have worked with Frank for a long time. He works prime time. Uh, he doesn't get up early like the rest of us. Uh, he said, <laughs> hide in your firewood pile. Yeah. Because right now, my firewood pile, it was, I am so anal retentive. Yeah. At the beginning of the season, it was stacked perfectly. When I went out and gathered firewood last night, I just grabbed what I could and got back inside. It's For a mess. Sure. Yeah. So. Well, in this cold weather, of course, you know, you don't want to spend extra time outside. 11 degrees. So just roll this out. And guys, when you get this home, it's going to come just rolled up in a box. You just unroll it. There's it, nothing to do. Yeah. Cut it down if you need to do that. Uh, but just really all of those areas. And it is gorgeous. It's treated to delay the effect of fading from the sun. Beautiful. So it is outdoor They did safe. a nice job on yeah, it. Yeah, indoors so too. So how many leaves on the six foot? Over 1,100 leaves on the six That's foot. That's just and look at, amazing. Just, let's just hold this up just so we can stand. I'm standing behind here. You know, I have this white sweater on. You're, you're not seeing too much of that. There's really yeah. amazing. I have yet to find something that has this much coverage in, in an IV um, privacy fence. I, really, we have a lot. A lot of them, you, you just see the grid and then the leaves. On yep. ours, you see the leaves. Which is what you buy it for in the first place. Yeah, so, and then you don't see whatever's behind it, really. It's well wonderful. priced, beautifully done, smart, smart stuff. idea. And yeah. here's the best part. I think all of us can think of a couple of the areas of the house where you'd really like to be able to conceal things. Yeah, and you know And it, it almost disappears. You can make it a focal point if you want to, but more often than not, greenery, the eye follows it and you just right. forget it. Here's the classic this example. This is the greatest idea. You know, just those, tra I mean, every person in the world has a trash can. Well, the old, the old you know. plastic recycling, and and again, that to me, that looks like a jail. This I am is not a big ugly. fan and of I think we picked up one of the ugliest chain link fences there was out there. <laughs> but but, but this, yeah, it looks pretty. This terrible. ten foot section, and we're actually this, this six foot right here. This was a six foot, and actually this is cut down. We yeah. cut this down to about five feet. And that you. disappears in a matter of just a few moments with yeah. the zip ties that come with it. And you just need a pair of household scissors. Here's you don't good, need uh, any weird, funky, unique and Dan, tools. And we want to mention too, again, you want to cut only vertically, okay? Yes. So meaning, okay, this, it's long this way, yep. you want to cut down this way when you're cutting it to preserve the shape. Now, if you're doing it decoratively, you then might you want to snip in want. different ways, but yep. if you want to use that um, as coverage, you'll just cut that vertically, okay? And it's designed to last for years. Yeah. You just put it up and let it do its job. And its job is to conceal all those things that we have in around our property that are not the most attractive things. Yeah. And you know, Dan, it's so pretty and it does look so realistic. We put some Roberta's Echinacea out nice. here with it. And look how gorgeous that looks. That'll be coming up a little bit later on yeah, today. Yeah, love it. Michelle, thank you very, very much. Thank you, Dan. Have a great day. Thanks for being Me a part too. of our Spring Fever program. Coming up, uh, this blower we've had on the air before. Customers loved it. Now we've got a price on it that is absolutely the best price I've ever seen. A